Hello my people, it's a beautiful day in Uganda, Kampala, in the continuation of my VIP access series from Kampala. I'm sitting right here to a super cool artist, super stylish, the reggae dance hall genius, Bini Ganta. Greetings, greetings to the world. I feel so blessed. I feel so good. It's so good to actually meet you because we've been talking for a long time and finally we meet. I love your swag, your music, your music videos. It's been such a journey to follow, um, you know, your content and to be with you finally. It feels like a, gr a great moment for me. <laughs> yeah, we, we, we give thanks to God because um, sometimes in life we make plans but we never know exactly when things are going to happen. So when finally God makes things happen, we just give thanks to Almighty God. I wanted to ask you about your genre of music like reggae dancehall and despite the fact that um, a lot of like reggae dancehall artists end up sounding a certain way, I feel like you've stuck to your um, Luganda roots, Ugandan roots and when I hear your songs, you're, you're doing the reggae dancehall thing even in Luganda, you know, how have you maintained that? Basically the whole thing is about being original and, and the way I work is, is not just me, it is me and my God. So there is no way I think I'm going to go wrong with the music if I'm still making it with God. Because before we get to the studio to record a song, I first pray to God, let's do this together. So whatever music I put out is what we do with my God. So whatever it is, yeah. Tell me about the direction of your music videos because I always do um, features on like the best videos from Africa every year. And I think since 2017 I've been featuring your videos. Um, there's like Pon Me with DJ Stuart and DJ Roger and so many others. But The direction is still from the, 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 origi the, the originality of the work. Yes. Because me as an artist, before, before, before I do a song I have a vision, yeah? When I'm recording my music, I have a vision of what I'm singing about. So I contribute almost like 70% when it comes to the video concept. Yeah, because it's it's me who bears the dream. Tell me about your collabs with Scales. Uh, Scales has been uh, has been a great brother to me, and this is what this is the part where I know like every time you put in the work, it's gonna pay ultimately someday. Because these are people who are international, people who just come down here to work, but when they recognize talent, like he appreciated my talent to an extent of doing more than three songs with me. And right now we have Bomb Blast. The level that he left me is different from the level that I am today. And that makes him proud. And that makes me proud as well to know like um, there, are, there are real people in the world. This is an inspiration for me to do the same thing for the next artist who will be maybe coming, who need a wing. Let's support each other, let's spread love because we need love. It's all about love. Okay. Um, tell us about the new album, No Fear, which is already out for... The album is called No Fear. This is basically my musical life. Like I've worked all my life for this because in the beginning when I was doing this, a lot of people tried to style me because they thought like maybe you have to follow a trend so that you can sell. but. I held on to my guns and I held on to my God to know that I had to stay original because if I do a song today, I want to do my song once and it is just once, it, is, it will live for years. We've learned from, from the great people and we still listen to their music and we feel like there's nothing we want to change. So I want to do music where after 30 years, no artist is going to come and disrespect my work. Yeah, so basically that's, that, that's the pre. I mean, congratulations. I know it's been a long time coming and we're really excited. Yeah, yeah. I'm so excited, man. You don't know. You don't know. 25 tracks. Oh. 25 tracks on one album and every song is, is real, like, from the heart. Ooh. Yeah, it is real. So it is, it is just, it is edutainment. It is entertainment. Okay. Yeah. So tell me about um, the support that know you have needed as an artist and where you've gotten the support because I know recently you got signed to Talent um, Africa you know since the signing what has been happening to the brand and where do you see um, the brand going in the next couple of months or even in 2019 uh, immediately after the signing we, we got focused on the dream like we, now we saw things starting to happen like um, things coming to reality and it is a great thing for, for, every, for every artist, for every organization to have organized people and focused people who, the, who are working to push the dream. Because at the end of the day, I cannot push the dream myself. 
you understand so we just need the right people and these are the right people ever since we signed to to talent africa we're gonna release the album you're gonna see we taking over the world <laughs> fantastic we cannot wait and the next thing i think your fans from across africa want to see you you know so when should we expect some tours maybe in um, the rest of east africa uganda tanzania burundi ethiopia maybe west africa now that you're cool with chaos maybe you guys can do a show in nigeria maybe Definitely, before the end of the year, we're gonna Skills is gonna have a concert. We're gonna go and support him in Nigeria. We're gonna do a media tour around Africa. Uh, you can follow us on www.biniganta.com on our website. You have all the information and the updates about about our our tours. Yeah. Tell me about Gantok. <laughs> <laughs> Gun talk, gun talk. This is my record label. Um, it is something that, 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 that defines me yeah. as a person, okay. defines my music. When I say gun talk, a gun talk is a gunshot. Yeah. So if anybody boss a gunshot, if anyone, if anyone shoots around here, we're all not going to stay the same. And that's the, that's the feeling my music brings because I always try to make sure that I'm different. My sound is different. Yeah. And that has always been my focus. And the gun talk is something you cannot violate. It is not something you, you just have to deal with or talk to. It is something that will come straight because it is straight. So that is gun talk city to the world. What do you want to say to your Ugandan fans, especially because you know they have accepted you and your sound? The best thing I can tell you, like, first of all, I want to thank you, everyone that supported me starting with you, Nico, because. I know it's been like how many years now, like three, two years back, yeah. I want to thank everyone for supporting and keep, keep supporting Bini Ganta music. And then the best thing I can tell you is that um, right now in the world, if, if, if we are to focus on something, we're supposed to focus on love. We're supposed to focus on, on, on supporting each other. I just want to say thank you so much for this chance to interview you. Um, thank you so much for your music, um, your vibes, your creative direction. It's very inspiring. It makes me proud to be like, this is one of us from East Africa. You know, even though you're from Uganda, I'm like, it's ours too. <laughs> and I really wish you the best as you release the new album called No Fear. But before we leave, Bini has something to say. But yeah, but yeah, you too, but so well, uh, Young Talk City to the world now. Make sure so you keep it like it's original, real, and proper, well connected straight out of the Young Talk City to the world now. You already know. But yeah, but yeah, you too, but so well, uh, yeah. And the VIP access is on YouTube. Make sure next week you see who I'm going to be interviewing. Subscribe to my channel. And from uh, Bini and me, we're capping off.